Right, tips, or a tip. Right, you know, this is just what I do, and there may be other people that do this. So I made a bunch of pasta last night, and I, I, did, I did actually make too much, right? My eyes are bigger than my belly, all the time. But sometimes I will make some, um, some quinoa, some pasta, some rice, or like a potato, like curry type thing, and we'll make some for the next day, or if I know I'm going to come back on the ride. Uh, or from a ride, I've got some food waiting for me, all right? Um, these haven't been fridged. I, it's, the worst thing ever is like cold pasta from the fridge, right? One day isn't going to hurt, right? As long as it isn't like too warm. And if it's like a cool area, then that's fine. That sort of temperature, all right? But fridge, oh, horrible, man, all right? But obviously, if you want to eat them, say, in a day or two's time, max. Otherwise, you know, fresh is best and all that. Then, yeah, chuck them in the fridge. Overnight oats, completely different thing. But cold pasta, no, it just doesn't sit right with me. So, being for a ride today, come back, smash this down. You haven't got to worry about making anything. There's a meal there waiting for you. Again, it's just an idea, something I forget sometimes. Um, you know, there's so many things we think about, isn't it? And, you know, things and... You think, oh, I'll do this this week, or I'll do this 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 dinner or lunchtime. You know, spontaneity. I like to mix it up. So that's what I've done. See you later. Oh, this is um not Domio. It's some pasta sauce. Olive. Tomato. There's a bit of oil in there, but, you know, I don't always have this one. Anyway. See you later. Grub on. Right, another thing you can do is check your tyres for Sharpies before. Right, sorry, we got cut off. So basically, just go around your tyre and check it for debris, sharps and stuff. So going out for a little ride, there's my water bottle. Again, it's something which a lot of people are doing, but it does make for a simple sports drink I guess if you want to add some lime some lemon or a little bit of pinch of salt whatever but some sugar in this case that I use all sorts of sugar whatever sugar sugar uh, with a bit of water in there give it a good old shake and then when you're out on the bike every sort of every swig tip it upside down and give it a swig um a shake around because you can get build up of sugar in the bottom there so it just keeps it mixed up that's all so yeah cheap sports drinks